and that's the case with the um, revenues. They're supposed to increase um, stockholders' benefits. The effects of debits and credits on revenue accounts is the same as their effect on stockholders' equity. So revenues increase stockholders' equity, and expenses decrease stockholders' equity, don't they? Stockholders' equity relationships. Here's a great one where you look at your assets, your liabilities, and then you have something called stockholders' equity. Common stock is the money investors are putting into the company, whereas retained earnings is that net income that hasn't been taken out of the business yet. So that net income increases stockholders' equity. I think what I'm going to do here, guys, is I'm going to stop here and we'll start up here on Thursday. But what I would like you to do is if you can go home and review these exercises and read. How many of you guys have read through a part of the chapter? I want you guys to go back and see how you can, you know, think it through again. And this is the important piece. When you have a question, when you're like sitting there doing the work, you don't just go, oh, I'm going to try to figure it out on Thursday because this stuff is paramount right now. I want you to either talk to a friend or email me. And you email me and say, this is where I'm getting stuck. Do you see what I'm saying? And then those pieces you email me on, I'm going to respond back to you. But even better, we're going to go over some of those things on Thursday. You guys make sense? Does it? Okay. You guys have a wonderful day. The weather's getting better. I love it. I just love it. Yes. Here, I'm going to turn it down a little. Yes. So. I, I know I couldn't get $2 at the end. Is there? I, I think I gave full credit for that or maybe took off one point. Um, you'll have the solution. The solution's in there. That's what I was asking for. Of course. Do I just go right back to the and put on the link? Yes, so but the people solutions. say they can't get into it. Because that's, can I, sh what, you know what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have someone help me. Because I set the quiz up that after the quiz closes, you all can, look at everything, class distribution and everything, and for some reason, it's not working. So you'll be able to see the answers. Okay, so I will I will work on that today, this afternoon. Yeah. I might have to just email Stu and say, what am I doing wrong? Yeah. Okay, so I will get that. But you were so close that I think I gave you almost full credit for it. I must have break there like seven times, and if it wasn't for the three hours that you gave us instead of the one hour, I would have never and I think what I'm going to do next time, I heard everyone say I will set up templates because I don't want you spending your time doing my new stuff. So I'll set up a template in Excel so you can just do your additions. Yeah, Excel is a lot easier. I think you either forgot a dividend or maybe you didn't take into account depreciation on that. I can't remember which one, but I know I remember you because you wrote me and said I worked on this and I'm not balancing. And it was something so simple. Yeah. But you had one side right, just not the other. Okay, so the, the solutions will be on there? They're, they're all on there. Okay. Sorry if you can eventually see it. Okay. Sorry about that. Here, one second. What are you guys uh, at? I'm just curious, those post and test scores include the extra Nope, I'm going to do that today. Everyone gets 10 extra points. The reason I didn't do it, I was thinking you guys could all look at your answers. And does it have the answers? Yes. And I. Yes, everything. It has what you answered right, what you had answered the wrong, and then the solution. So I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but today, today I will go in. Then in your grade section, not in the quiz, but in your grade, I'm going to add an extra ten points. Just well, in the grade, not in the quiz score. No. Okay. Well, I, this is my deal. I would rather add a section to the um, with that quiz, add ten extra points, right. because. If then, somebody wants to drop the quiz and they don't miss out on that. That's well, what I'm thinking, at least. If you've no, the, this is just for this quiz. Oh, okay. So okay. what I don't want to do is confuse everyone with, well, 
you, you know, I'm trying to make how many you lost that it all makes sense. In the past when I do extra credit and then I add to it and then say I go and change something else, it screws up the grade because it only shows which has really been calculated instead of this extra credit. It, it's more of a, I just don't want to screw it up and then you lose it because it didn't get added at the end of the, th the day. That's why I want everyone to look at their scores before I added them. Anyway, I'm not making sense to you, but um, I need to find out how to get you guys to go in and look at Moodle so you can see your quizzes. And then as long as I know you guys all agree with the solutions, see what happens is, say someone emails me and said, says, well, you know, the reason I answered this is because da, 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 da. And I go, you know, you're kind of right. I'm going to give you credit for it. If I do that, then you're going to lose that 10 points because I have to do that at the very end. Because I don't remember who all gets the extra it's temper. Gonna raise the actual test score. It's going to raise your test scores by 10 points. So if you made a 77, it'll be 87. Yeah. It's going to be significant for you. But it's for this test. Just because I wasn't here and I felt like I harmed you. And I'm so sorry. Does it, am I making sense what I'm telling you? Yeah. Okay. Ted, you're Ted, right? Kevin. Kevin, gosh, you see, I'm bad. So, does that answer your questions? Oh, uh, no, I was going to say if you're having a hard time putting your Augsburg email on your phone, I know how to do it. Kevin, will you? Oh, God, that would be so awesome. I have it on my phone. So. Okay, what do I, I need to give you? Um, Can I give this to you? Uh, do you have an iPhone? That's yes. Uh, download the Gmail app from the App Store. I have Gmail on here already. You do? Mm-hmm. Because oh. my Shoemake CPA is a Gmail account. Okay. So, okay. Uh, and you uh, want my passwords? So Augsburg, Augsburg is a Gmail account as well. Yes. So what you can do then... Yeah, let's Email me. And then um, I'm going to post this. It's good to know that I can drop the quiz. Cause I Absolutely. Well, and the thing was, is like it was my fault. Because I like. Can I tell you something? The fact that you even, oh, like when people, when people will come to me and go, you know what? It's just a totally screwed up did it. But the fact that you're like, God, I wish I could have done this different. I am working with you. I will do anything to work with you. No, yeah, no. There's, I don't. I'm not that student. It's like, oh, it's all your fault. Yeah. Because I know but, it's not. But, it's like stuff I could have done better. But, but my point is, we're gonna work together to get you to do better. And if you have to eventually drop two quizzes. Well, no, and I mean, I'm not worried about it. I think it's just that, like, I honestly, like, I'm in, like, really hard classes. Mm -hmm. And, and this stressing. is, like, my easiest class. Right. And so I'm thinking of it as my easiest right. class. And it's not easy. Right. So I was like, oh, this quiz will take me a half an hour. Yeah. And I give myself a half an hour at a coffee shop before I went to go hang out right. with my friend. And, you're and then I was getting super frustrated because right. I was like, holy shit. Like, I'm sorry. Right. I don't know this. Right. And you know no what I mean? Problem. And so it's that, gonna, it was my fault. It's going to take you a little more effort. Oh, do you know what yeah. I mean? I know. I know. I know. So, now. but anything I can do to help, email me. I'm here yeah, to help I think, you guys. I think once I spend some time with it, yeah, I'll be you'll fine. be good. But, okay, thank you. Let's fill that up. Shoemake. Yeah. Okay, yeah. awesome. My name, oh, that's my Nancy. <laughs> um, I know some of this technology, while it's great, it's just email is shoemake at Augsburg. So you think um, I'm screwed on my... Your, your, ex your oh. external hard drive is probably toast. What happened? For sh dropping it too many times? Maybe. That and you, see, you said you put it in the freezer. Well, they told me, someone told me to do that. Really? They said, <laughs> they said that that helps sometimes. I heard that from numerous people. Weird. I've never heard that before. Really? Really. Somehow it... <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm here. Here's Augsburg. Yep, so it's in there. So now you should be able to go to... Here you go. Get out of town. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you. Extra... Kevin. Yep. Okay, I'm going to keep thinking Ted. i got to go Kevin. Yeah, Thank Ted you. sits next to me. Okay, that's where I'm getting it confused. Yeah. You, you can come on in. Thank you so much. I sure appreciate it. Yes. something I 
is this time? Religion 200. What are you learning? 